You guys, it is your girl Lanisha, aka Nisha the Barbie, whatever you want to call me. And today I am back with another video. Y'all already know what I'm going to say. Go ahead and click that subscribe button because we are on our way to 100 subscribers. And if you are not new here, just please keep on watching. Today's video is going to be on unpopular opinions. So, the term of an opinion is exactly so don't be sitting here critiquing me what anyway i don't really care i want y'all to get mad so let's just start this don't show your newborn babies they're all pale when they first come out of a vagina and people they're very critical I mean, people are going to criticize you everywhere, critique you, whatever you do. But me personally, whenever I decide to have kids, I am not going to show them until they're probably two weeks old so I can know, hey, is my baby going to be dark skin? Is my baby going to be light skin? She's going to have my features. Is she going to have her daddy's features? I don't know. That's me. I don't care what y'all say. If you are not black, do not say the N-word. That doesn't need an explanation. Point blank, period. We're done talking about it. I feel like y'all should agree with me on this jordan woods is flourishing without kylie jenner now pause do not say anything let me finish on last week's episode of keeping up with the kardashians kim said whatever kylie has given her as in money cars whatever she's paid for as them being friends Jordan has used this to support her family. Now, yes, Kylie has given Jordan a lot amount of gifts because they said that, you know, Kylie doesn't really open up to trusting people. So that's why her and Jordan were so close. I mean, the girls live together. Are you crazy? That's that's Stormy's godmother, I'm pretty sure. If nobody else, if Stas is not Stormy's godmother, I'm pretty sure Jordan is. So, um, yeah, this girl has a collaboration with Boohoo. She's been out and about doing like athletic wear and stuff like that. So I really don't care what nobody says. She might have, but without Kylie, Jordan is that bitch. Donald Trump is the most annoying person up on Twitter. Not up on there, but on there. He's the most annoying person in the world. Every time I get on the shade room, he's always talking about Hillary Clinton. He's always talking about Joe Biden. He's always talking about, you know, he's just running his mouth. For me, and I speak for the whole black community when I say this, Barack Obama is forever my president. Because that orange Cheeto, like, if Barack Obama could have been elected for two more, for uh, more than two terms, I would have voted for him tenfold over on trump i'll be 24 when he it, when he's done being president i don't want that no more i'm not here for that i'm not here for kamala harris either she's not she's not my cup of tea either seinfeld and friends is overrated that show is so freaking boring i can't even sit through an episode of it i can sit through an episode of big bang theory because sheldon makes me laugh i don't know if it was because it's trying to pitch the idea of what a friendship should be like when y'all are grown i don't know i just can't it ain't nothing for me to explain because i don't really understand it like that so yeah and seinfeld was just not funny either people who eat whole kit kats are ridiculous like y'all know when people have a kit kat there's four bars if you sit there and eat it like that you're stupid that's not what it's for. It's meant to be broken off to share with somebody. That's why the that's why Chance the Rapper was like, break me off a piece of that Kit Kat bar. That's why he did that because it, those are instructions, directions on how to properly eat a Kit Kat. I walked in Walmart. Somebody was walking out of Walmart, and they bit straight into their Kit Kat. Weird. Steak is disgusting. I am not a steak person. And y'all want to know why I'm not a steak person? Because. I really can't even back this up. But I don't like steak. <laughs> steak is disgusting. That's just that on that. 
Why is 6 9 famous? He's so obnoxious. Him and Donald Trump, they're both childish. Got a big 6 9 on his head. He can fit on my forehead. My forehead is large enough. Empire was trash after the first season. You want to know why? Because they had too many cliffhangers. Too many people were dying. They were losing too many characters. It was trash. Empire came. Then didn't Empire and Power come out at the same time? I'm not sure. Not that I care. But I love Taraji P. Henson. I love Soraya. I love Terrence Howard. It, at first, um, when it first came on the first season, of course, everybody knows that it was just like a spinoff of Hustle and Flow. Or at least that's what I thought. Queen and Nyjah's music sounds the same. She has the same, like, tempo. She has the same, like, you know, her music is just, I don't know how to say it. She's an amazing singer. Do not get me wrong. But her music is starting to sound the same. It has the same concept. It talks about, you know, it's always about her and another person or her going through something with another person. Keeping up with the Kardashians, it's played out. They've done that show for 16 years. That's that. And then everybody knows that reality tv these days is not reality tv anymore now flavor Flav and i love new york that was some real shit but i think they're scared to not be on tv because people are kind of gonna forget about them cookies and cream milkshakes are useless now don't get me wrong i will get an oreo mcflurry in a heartbeat but just blended cookies and vanilla ice cream Somebody who thought of it was a genius. I mean, I love it, but it's useless. Ketchup should be kept cold. Do not put your ketchup in a cabinet, a hot cabinet at that, and then expect me to come over to your house. Uh. Hawaiian pizza is disgusting. Whoever came up with that, y'all are disgusting because fruit should not go on a pizza. That's all I have for you guys today. I will do a part two. Just let me know, you know, like it, comment, subscribe to this channel. Let me know what you want to see next. If I'm too turned, if I'm too boring, if I need to do something else. Y'all said that I should start showing my outfits. But today is a plain Jane outfit. I didn't put on any earrings. I just have on makeup. I have on nothing. Thank you for watching. And you guys, I will see you in my next video. Goodbye. Goodbye.